Today we explore the bizarre beginnings of the handheld flashlight. Travel back to the year 1896, where a young inventor named Joshua Cohen reasoned that the combination of the newly introduced portable battery combined with a small light bulb could create a product with mass appeal. So Cohen invented the obvious, the electric flower pot. After placing batteries inside a tube with a light bulb on the end, Cohen placed the entire gadget into a flower pot with the assumption that people stumbling around in the dark needed to see well-lit petunias. At about this time, a business associate named Conrad Hubert, seeing the obvious potential of the electric flower pot, purchased the rights and began mass production. Surprisingly, however, the public did not want light-up flower pots, and Hubert was left with a large overstock and an even larger debt. In a last-ditch attempt to salvage a portion of his investment, Hubert removed the tube, batteries and bulb from the pot, added a lens, and began to sell the electric hand torch, or flashlight. As it turns out, the flashlight was an instant hit, and Conrad Hubert went on to start the EverReady Flashlight Company, which is still producing batteries and flashlights to this day.